The driver accused of causing a deadly crash on 95 in North Attleboro faces a judge. 12 News reporter Sheena Loshuto is live outside court right now with the very latest for us. Sheena. Well, the suspect here is accused of causing that fatal crash that really shut down the highway for hours yesterday in North Attleboro, and then police say he also left the scene. The suspect, 50-year-old Joseph Pompey of Cranston, just faced a judge here in Attleboro at the courthouse, pleading not guilty to his several charges. This is video of him we just got from the courtroom. Mass State Police say his car made contact with a white SUV on 95 South, which went into the opposite side of traffic and then crashed into a black sedan. Now, the driver of that sedan, 58-year-old Randall Ricketts of Foxborough, later died. The driver of that white SUV has only been identified as a 61-year-old man from Providence. He remains in critical condition. We're also now learning that there was a 5-year-old in that white car, although we are told the 5-year-old is in stable condition. Police say they found the defendant a short time later and then arrested him. Now, Pompey was held on $50,000 cash bail, and we just spoke to his lawyer. His lawyer tells us that his client denies being involved in this car crash. He says his car did not hit any other car yesterday. Certainly a lot to comb through. A lot of details were read in that courtroom. We'll have much more for you later tonight. For now, reporting live in Attleboro, I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News.